Today I'm going to show you how to make coffee just as good as Starbucks. And if you have a recipe that you'd like to share with us, please leave a comment or video response. Now I'm going to start with the ingredients that you're going to need to make this delicious coffee. First, you're going to need a coffee maker. Right here we have your basic Mr. Coffee coffee maker that you can get at Walmart for about $30. It comes with the utensils that you need. Also, you're going to need an espresso roast uh, Starbucks coffee. You can get that from Walmart, about $7. Also, you're going to need some ground cinnamon. Suggest that you get some 1% milk. You're going to need some sugar, of course, that's what makes it sweet. And then you're going to need some water, and I prefer to use bottled or spring water for these. Okay, now let's get started. First, we're going to get our coffee machine ready. We're just going to take off the top, and we're going to get our bottle of water. And we're going to pour it all the way in until it is full not spill it like that. Now once it's all the way full, we're just going to stick our lid back on, screw it back on the tight, and now we're going to get the coffee that we need. What we're going to do is we're just going to pour it in here about three quarters of the way full. Now once you start pouring it in, you want to kind of pack it in a little bit to make sure we get all the coffee that we need. Okay, once you get that in there about too full, then we're going to stick it in the machine. Now depending upon your taste in coffee, you may wish to add more or less coffee grounds. We're just going to turn on our machine, let it start brewing, it's that simple. Now that our coffee is brewed, we're going to add removing sugar, the good stuff, to it. We're going to get about three teaspoons of sugar. There's one, two, big full three one. I like lots of sugar. Now we need to add our milk. We need to add about a third of a cup. mix our milk and sugar. You want to make sure you're mixing it now and not when you mix it with the coffee. Now we're going to steam it, so I'm just going to turn it to my setting. And we're just going to shake it round and round, about per minute. This is just like you see in Starbucks. Okay, now that we're done steaming, we're just going to add our espresso. Make sure you don't stir this. We're just going to pour it in. We're just going to sprinkle the top of it with some cinnamon. Just sprinkle it on top. Just adds a little bit of flavor. Makes it look really nice. You have a fresh cup of espresso and about the time that it takes at the drive through at Starbucks. And it's much cheaper. And remember, if you have a recipe that you'd like to share, make sure you post it in a comment or a video response. Cheers!